In this video, we'll balance the equation Na plus NH3. Let's count the atoms up on each side of the equation. We have one sodium, one nitrogen, and three hydrogens. On the product side, one sodium, one nitrogen, and then two hydrogens, plus we have these two here. So we have a total of four hydrogen atoms. When I have an odd number like this, and then an even number here, it's often helpful to get this to be an even number. So if we put a coefficient of 2, 3 times 2, that would give us 6. So that might help us out. This 2, though, applies to everything. So we have 1 times the 2 for the nitrogen. That gives us 2 nitrogens. Let's fix the nitrogens, because that will change the hydrogens again. So we have 2 here and 1 here. So we'll put a coefficient of 2 in front. We have 1 sodium times 2. That gives us 2 sodiums. 1 nitrogen times the two. So now the nitrogens are balanced. And let's update the hydrogen atoms. We have two times two. That gives us four hydrogens plus these two right here. And that gives us six. So the hydrogens are balanced, which is great. Now the sodiums, we have two here and one here. And that's easy because the sodium's all by itself. We put a two here. It doesn't affect anything else. The one times the two, that gives us two. And we're done. Everything's the same on each side of the equation. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for sodium plus ammonia. Thanks for watching.